Hi friends, welcome back. Um, so this week, I'm actually filming this at the end of the week, but whatever. Um, this week, I'm just gonna do sort of a vlog style, catch you up on what I work on when I work on it, and we'll see how that happens and what you like, what you don't like, let me know, drop a comment. Yeah, so stick around, here's what I worked on this week. Okay, friends, forgive the absolutely terrible angle. I'm sorry, I'm driving, but you'll hear why in a second. Okay, so basically, um, I was seized by this like amazing writing idea, and that's just not convenient to like real life. So let me explain. I have talked about this before, but I'll explain it real briefly again, because you know, you're a captive audience and I'm driving, what do you think I'm doing? Um, <laughs> I have like, you know, ideas come to me and I try to write them down in my idea journal, just however they come to me. Sometimes they're short, two sentences, whatever. Um, and then I go back to my idea journal later and if it develops into something, I do an outline and then the story, whatever. But the point is I was in the shower this morning and I got this really cool idea. And unfortunately, you know, I'm a working mom and I have a job and a life and I have things to do and, and I just did not have time to do anything with that idea. So I thought it would sim it would die out, you know, but instead as I've been driving the kids to school and I'm trying to think about like other things I'm trying to think about other stuff instead that idea is still there and it's getting bigger and it's growing and it's like becoming something I'm really excited about and I'm gonna be honest that hasn't happened in a really long time it just hasn't like lately I've been having muted mild ideas or I've been almost forcing things or having to do research and get myself over a hump and it hasn't happened in a while that an idea is like okay wait I have to write this um not just like I have to write it so I don't forget it but like I have to write this and so um, that's really cool. So I'm new trying to do this whole vlogging and keeping you updated and give you updates like live as they happen. And that's where I am right now with this idea rolling around in my head and I really need to get it written down. So I have a feeling today is going to work like it used to work back in the day. Like when I first wrote Breaking Iselda, um, you know, I was working full time and it was often like I have a break or on my lunch, I'm like scribbling down ideas for the story and I'm editing at 4am and I'm just I have a feeling that's going to be how this one goes because I'm really busy and it's, I live in the United States, it's Thanksgiving week right now. Um, you know, we got a lot going on this week and it's just been crazy, but this, this needs to get written. This needs to get put down on paper. So anyway, this is literally live the day that I'm coming up with it. I can't tell you much about it yet because who knows what'll happen with it. Um, except that I'm excited and I'm fired up in a way that I haven't been in a while. And we shall see how it goes. Uh, yeah, so there's your update. I'll try to catch myself on video later, like vlogging style, when I actually have time to sit down and work on it. Uh, sorry for the weird angle. You're literally in my car like cup holder so that I can film it safely while still driving safely. And uh, yeah, that's what's up. So there's your update. Ooh, wish me luck. Good morning. <laughs> uh, let's see, it's like 7 a.m. and it's the day before the holiday. So my kids don't have school, so that means I have extra time because I'm always trying to squeeze in time when I can to work on stuff. And today I just happen to have extra time because I don't have to go take the kids to school because they don't have school today. So I'm gonna work on a new project that um, is in my head that I need to get out and we're just gonna you know, see what happens. And uh, it also happens to be my birthday, so I'm probably gonna get interrupted with a lot of dings and messages, and I'm just gonna try to plow through them. So we'll probably end up fast forwarding through a lot of the typing stuff, but I'll pause if anything cool comes up that I need to tell you about. That's the plan. All right, so I started to put notes down for the idea yesterday, so I sort of need to read through where I was, and then I can just sort of let it flow again. It was really flowing yesterday, and I was really feeling the project, and then, you know, life. So I'm gonna see if I can make more progress. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, so it's still flying. So the idea here that I was working on, and I'm not really going to talk too much about what it was just yet because I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with it. Um, it's really just a strong scene. And I kind of knew that. Um, yeah, it's really just a strong scene. Uh, but I am going to do something that I do have plans for. it. I do have an idea for it. So, yeah. So I'm not sure how many words it's going to be. I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to add to it. But that's what I was planning on working on today. Um, other things I need to try to get done today because I have time and we'll see if I can get them done. I should be able to is, um, the audiobook narrator did accept the offered contract, which is really awesome. So she's actually already started and she sent me a 15 minute, they, um, you'll get a 15 minute sample first. So you can all make sure you're on the right page, give each other feedback, that kind of thing. And then 
from there, they'll go on and do the rest after they get your feedback. So she sent me the 15 minute audiobook sample and I do need to listen to and approve that. I haven't done that yet. So that's on the docket for today as well. So that's really, I get asked all the time, like, how do I squeeze in, you know, full-time writing and life, um, all that stuff and still get books out. And that's really it. I squeeze time whenever I can. So today the kids are asleep and they don't have school this morning. And so I'm just going to have that extra time. And I'm going to use that hour to try to get the scene out of my head and onto paper and probably read through it again and make sure I still love it. And then, um, hopefully listen to that 15 minute audio book sample thing and give feedback to that. So that's the big plan in one hour today. That's what I'm squeezing in. I'll check in with you at the end, let you know how much I actually got done. I'm getting back to work. All right, it took me half an hour and I managed to get like 3,500 words, which is the full scene, the full, <laughs> the full scene is done. I've also managed to completely ignore the text messages for a while, so that's good. So I'm going to go listen to the audiobook and I'll come back and check in with you in a little bit. All right. It's been like another, I don't know, 20 minutes or so. Audiobook is approved. That 15 minute was amazing. She's really come alive and like nailed um, both this, the first 15 includes one Angela, one Tanya, no Emily. So she's really just come alive and they're absolutely perfect. And I had like little to no notes for her and just amazing. So I'm really excited. Spark of Magic is getting an audiobook. I got both of the things I wanted to get done today done. So, you know, check, check, work those off. And then I got other things to do. So I'm going to go. So you have a good day. Keep planning the path to your dreams. See you later. Okay, so that was the big plan. The big plan was to film anytime I work this week and you can see that wasn't a whole lot of video. So honestly, it was a crazy week um, with a birthday thing and then Thanksgiving and then my son plays travel hockey. So the hockey tournaments, which were in town, but they're an hour away. So that's like an hour driving. They have to be there an hour early, two hour game and an hour back. And there were four games. So it was just a lot. It was just a lot. So I didn't get a whole heck of a lot done, but I got some writing done on that secret project. More on that later and what the heck else did I do? I approved the 15 minute audiobook sample. I don't know what the heck else I did. Let's hope the next weeks are more successful. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you worked on this week. And if yours was better and more productive than mine, uh, make sure you hit subscribe, tap the bell so you know when I'm back and I will see you next time. Keep plotting the path to your dreams. Bye. <laughs>